Right, Jennifer, thank you. 632 right now. Brand new this morning, just as the rodeo kicks off, an HPD bait truck is stolen from NRG Park, and the man responsible is still on the run. Houston police say around 1230 in the morning they were notified one of the bait cars sitting in the NRG lot got stolen. Officers spotted it near the loop and wayside. The driver eventually ended up on Cedar Crest and Midvale, where he abandoned the truck because HPD officers turned it off. He got out, took off running into the woods. Police used the helicopter and the canine to try to find him, but were unable to. And that's not all that happened at the rodeo last night. I know. During the check wagon races, one of the drivers was thrown off his wagon in front of the crowd. Our Jake Reiner is live at NRG this morning with the very latest. And Jake, is that driver okay this morning? Well, Rachel, we're told that he is. He was uh, alive and awake at the hospital last night, but as you mentioned, certainly an eventful night at the rodeo, all things considered. An intense chuck wagon race took a turn for the worst. A source close to the rodeo says the driver was unconscious before he hit the ground. He just tumbled and just went limp. Rodeo officials say he was taken to the hospital, and the source says he regained consciousness there. It was very, very scary. And then the horses went crazy. But all of a sudden, we saw this man just go flying off of the, you know, where he was riding, you know, and just, it was so unexpected. The horse crashed into a wall, and although it suffered a concussion, officials say it will be okay. Again, the horse and the driver of that wagon are both expected to be okay. We're still working to try and find out what led that truck wagon driver to fly off the wagon like he did. Before right now, we're live at NRG Park. Jake Reiner, KPRC, Channel 2 News.